In Tahlequah today, the Cherokee Nation and family celebrating their iconic chief, Wilma Mankiller, and a Barbie doll made in the late chief's likeness. The celebration on the very day she was sworn in more than three decades ago in 1985. News Force Caitlin Ogle has more. These Wilma Mankiller dolls sold out quickly, and now they're on back order. But the Cherokee Nation says they're more than just dolls. They're a symbol of empowerment, hoping to inspire a young generation of female trailblazers. That woman was as close to perfection as any of us could ever dream to be. Family of Wilma Mankiller and the Cherokee Nation celebrating the newest addition to Barbie's inspiring women's series. Barbie. Hi, Barbie. See you, Barbie. I the doll commemorates the Cherokee Nation's first female principal chief. She was sworn in back in 19. And led the tribe for a decade. They did sell out, as you know, within 24 hours. I think about these little Cherokee children playing with their grass dolls. And today, we have Cherokee children playing with the Wilma Mankiller Barbie. Mankiller focused on improving social conditions and restoring pride in Native heritage. Mankiller embodied qualities of strength, resilience, and trailblazing leadership to align with Barbie's mission to inspire and empower. Mankiller proving to be inspiring to current tribal leaders. If a chief will tell you the truth, they'll say they want to be Wilma Mankiller when they grow up. She used her power as chief to keep striking at the conscience of the United States for its broken promises. Family and friends saying she continued to serve up until her death in 2010. The doll, a reminder of her legacy. There is still so much more we can do. There is still so much woman man killer in each and every one of us. And we need to strive every single day to show as much of her as we possibly can. Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4. All right, Caitlin, thank you. Now here's the doll <laughs> yes. right here. And I got to tell you, there's been some controversy over the doll's likeness to Wilma Mankiller. Her husband says he is certain she would be pleased with how it came out and would laugh at the critics. It is a beautiful doll. It really is.